Hello everybody, this is Refresh and I'm here to do Premiere Draft for Lord of the Rings Tales of Middle-Earth. We have our one draft token, we'll get right into it. Alright, well, I think it's an easy Orcish Bowmasters. I've seen this being played once or twice and uh, it's just ridiculous. Whenever your opponent draws an extra card, it deals one damage and it amasses one and it jumps in whenever you want it to. It seems really good. I am passing Bill and Frodo. I think both of those are pretty good. And Armin's good in, in the Scry deck. But yeah, I think that it's an easy Orcish Bowmasters right here. All right. I mean, Grand could work if we're on Team Orcs. Starling Warg is not something I want to take first. Doors of Durin could be good, but I want to play black because of the Bowmasters, so I'm not going to take that early. Mushroom Rush Dogs is alright. Farsight's alright. Bombadil's alright. But yeah, I think uh, we'll just stay on the black train for now. There's nothing here that makes me really want to leave. I guess the Kingfisher's not bad, but we'll just take Grand since we are making armies here. And here. Nasty End is not bad. Troll Cause of Doom would get us a lot. I think Smite the Deathless might be the way to go. An instant deal three to target creature removal. Seems really good. It's probably better than the bats, which you can kill. I don't know if it's better than the troll, but I think it is just better enough that I'll take it in this particular case, and we'll see where we can go. That might put us into a red-black sacrifice theme and that way we're gonna hope for like nasty end to come back all right well shagra loop bearer is on color let's see what it does whenever attach up to one equipment to it that's not amazing but a four 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 that can uh, sometimes just get stuff off equipment is not bad i think the bats would be good too the berserker could be all right Torment of Golem, the Golem even is all right, but we'll take the rare and see how that works. Here, I like Mortar Muster. The Trebuchet could be all right as well. The Terrace could be all right. Hornberg is less good, I think, with my deck. I think we take Muster and try to get the Orcs going, but I'm not sure, maybe the Trebuchet is the actual correct pick, but I think this this will be easy to easier to get. And then we have nothing. Rally and Hornberg again, not what we want. We'll take the Terrace just to fix mana. Looks like white is getting passed quite a bit here, and so is green. Um, okay, I mean, do I want this Spearmaster? Rush the room is probably not it. I think the ambush can be all right here. Well, this does hit, let us hit decently. I think we'll take it. It's not like the best, but it kind of works with an aggressive format here. Let's see, this one drop might be all right. What does this warp to do? When it dies or another creature you control, the power four or dies, you amass two orcs. I have much is just Shagrat and Grand. I could take the axe. Probably not though. This is not bad. This is not bad. I think I'm on either this or this. I guess this is a weapon. It's cheap. Oh, well, I guess I took it. We'll take this because it's the only one in color. I don't think we're going to play this, but we'll take it. All right, uh, we'll take the basin. I don't think we're gonna play this. And then nasty end seems good. Casting the fire is a little too circumstantial, so yeah, we'll nasty end here. Then, yeah, I think inherited envelope. Probably not playing that, but maybe we can splash something in the future. Okay, nothing in color. We'll take the. I think we take the hobbit sting. We're not playing that either. All right, March in the Black Gate, I like. It's certainly better than this. Improvised Club is something that I might want if it comes with wheels. 
and this one, if you control a wizard, no, it's probably not for me. Especially since it's non color. We're gonna take March. And then another March. I'm passing Cribane, Troll. These two I'd love to get back. I'd even take the nasty end if it comes back, but I'll take a second March. And then uh, I think I'm gonna take the Mirkwood Bats. I think the Morgul Knife Wound is not the best removal. I guess it is still removal, but. Um, what is fire inscription? What if you cast an instant or sorcery? It deals two damage to each opponent. Mm, we'll take. I uh, swarming a warrior is not not bad either. How many instants and sorceries do I have? Two and one. Or maybe I'll take this. I feel like I should be taking bats though. Uh, we'll take bats. It's a little bit more in line with what I'm trying to do here. Uh, Coral's end. Markwood Bats. I actually think we take Denethor and splash him because this is really strong and uh, plays well with the sacrifice themes. And I don't know if we want a, a second Grand. I think I take the Crabane because that is just a nice value there. Curve is starting to shape up here. Uh, Oogluk with a white hand. Whenever a creature you control dies, it gets... Oogluk gets a counter. That seems decent. And we have a lot of those, so yeah. Display of power is definitely not getting played, so we'll take Oogluk here. Okay. The Crusher or the Warg. I guess we're mostly goblins and orcs, right? Three orcs. Oh, we're all over the place, actually. We have the army. This doesn't do much, except with the orcs as well. So, I think I'm slightly more on snarling warg, actually. Just the menace is a bit nicer. Uh, okay, I don't really like either of these. I'll take the medicine, I guess, because the mass one can matter. Okay, nothing in color for me. I'm just gonna take the uncommon. Uh, rush the room is on color. I guess I can play it. Morgul Knife Wound is back. We'll take that. We'll take cast. We're probably not playing that. We'll take the f fires of Ornthank. Well, I'm not playing that, so I might as well just take Y here and not play that. Alright. Ooh, Smeagol. Interesting. I think I'm taking Oath of the Great Host. I wouldn't mind the troll or the Dunland Crabane, but I think this is really strong. This is a little weird. I, I mean, I think it's good. There is value there, but I think I'm just going to take the thing that fits a little bit better into my deck. Uh, this is also, the Fire Leap is also good, but I think the Oath is strong. Then Golem, I think we take. Ooh, this is tough. Hothmog is also good. I think we're going to take Golem, though. Just because we already have the Nasty End. It might be a little bit better in this deck, but I think both of these would be really good in my deck, along with the Improvised Club. Maybe the War Beast is alright. I don't think this is what I want to be doing. I guess this is the card that I want, Mortar Muster. I could also take the Shadow Summoning and maybe splash that in alongside Denthor. Let's, let's try it. Flash of the Balrog is removal -y. I think it's better than any of these. That's, I think, it's the only thing that would compete. And then, we already have an Orcish Medicine. We'll take, oh, I guess I could take one of these, like the second Spear Master. No, we'll take the Torment of Golem. I mean, I'm not going to play a lot of these cards anyways. I have, to, I have too many fours. Um, I'll take the five drop, I guess. I don't have much. I don't have anything in five, actually. This is not great, because I don't have a lot that it gains from, but. All right. The Asherith Ungle Patrol actually fits into what this deck is trying to do. So we will take that. Let's see. Sam's Desperate Rescue. Return. 
I already have one. I don't think I want two of those, but what am I taking otherwise, right? Nothing of note. Here, the Fire Leaper came back. I'm happy to take that. Oh, Golem came back too. I'm not going to splash for Golem. I can actually use a Fire Leaper. And here, I could take another War Beast or I could take Gimli's Fury. I don't think I want either of these other ones. Fit to three. Let's take the War Beast. And here, we'll take Coral's End. I don't think I want this. Yeah, we'll take Coral's End. And now, we're, we, it doesn't matter, so we'll take Frodo. And now it doesn't matter, so we'll take Ryder. Now it doesn't matter, so we'll take this Scarecrow. All right, let's make some cuts here. So, that's an amass thing, that's fine. This is fine. Torment of Golem is probably too expensive. I don't know that I have enough orcs. I suppose I just need one, and then I have all of these ways to amass, so the war is okay, but I think this is still too many cards. In four, right? Or maybe I cut Grand. I need an army for this to work. Merkwood Bats is a team with this and this. Even this. Maybe I cut Shagrat and the Barrel Blade because those aren't that great here. We can probably cut Orcish Medicine. I think the warg will go. Can I cut Coral's End or maybe one of these fives? I think I cut. Or another four, perhaps. I think Shagrat might be the one to go. I mean, I only have one equipment, right? Otherwise, it's just a four, four, four. Let's just cut the four, 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 four. This is kind of the deck. It's a little bit more aggressive, but we'll see if it works. All right, here we go. Okay, I mean, we have all of our colors. Golem, March, seems good. Grand going the next turn. Or Ogloking. play this, but I think we just play Gron. And then, could swing with this, offer a trade for Arwen. But I think it's just better to leave it so I can attack with Gron.
All right, whatever that attempts you. Okay, put your choice of a counter. Wow. All right, whatever. Put one or more counters. Wow, okay. That's pretty good. the land. Now I can sort of do things, right? This attacks. Play this. Oh, we're gonna go to combat attack with Rond. this to be mana efficient. is going off. creature you control dies, so I can trade this for this. But I think I want to sack you to kill Aragorn. So I think I just take this particular hit. Interesting choice to do that now. Okay. We're going to... We sack so that we can play. Oh, we can't play the Corbane. So it's just better to pay the extra and just kill this now. And then trading Grand for Arwen is not the worst, so we'll go to combat and swing with Grand. Put a counter on the Golas. Uh -huh. I don't love that, but a Gluk will get bigger too, so. quickly if I don't do anything about that. We can play this equip swing. This. And then 
everybody blocks, that's not the worst for me. Go to combat. Then we'll attack. Uh, with Gron. I'm happy to trade that. Alright, Arwen is the one that I should kill, right? Maybe I have to kill Legolas because he keeps growing. I think Arwen's the one I have to kill. We'll see. Google keeps up with Legolas. It's not the worst thing in the world. And then we'll go to end. We'll grab a, a planes with the Shire Terrace. Okay. for this turn. block on the following, I guess. Oh, I forgot to do that. Well, we're gonna play the War Beast then. Swing with you. Okay, in the turn. Hopefully, they don't have removal for the crib bane. Is that removal? It's not. gonna do any good let me see if I cast this for two pump pump it doesn't have haste I can't sack it and quarrels and to discard this and draw two other cards and create some blockers on the ground I think we have to do this let's look for better answers here Ray host is not gonna save me though. All right, if I swing with all three, they have to block. But they have to block all three of them, and then I die on the crackback, right? Play this, go to combat. Swing with all three. Unfortunately, I don't have a way to stop the flyers, so I think I lose. We'll just cast this then. I'll give them the chance to coup de grammy if they like. Swing and kill me, or I'll concede. 
It was close. It was a close game. Okay, next game. I mean, I can cast this and this. I can't cast these two. But I think I have enough mountains. These are like, more expensive anyway, so I think we try this. Okay. Oh, interesting. Do I want to get the march down, or do I want to get the shadow summoning down? Let's march. second one of those. I mean, I can be unlucky, but that's fine. Get big. trade this guy for that, so we'll offer that trade. And we'll just play Rond. And this still attacks, so I guess that's alright. Oh no, it's not an army anymore. Oh, that's annoying. Well, I guess I'll be playing this, trying to get some food. Uh, yeah, we crew this. Crew with this. It's still crew Grand. So, just, just one less thing, right? Grand. Crew Grand. More gold knife than this thing. And then we go swinging. Flooded. Okay, next. Okay, I mean, I don't have black mana, but I can get black mana with the terrace. I think we keep this as low as it is. We got black mana. Alright then. Now we don't even need this except to get the second color if we need it. That's a, that's a thing. Well, the golden bone, I guess. Let's see. I can 
Balrog to kill this thing. No, I can't Balrog to kill this thing. I, no, I can't not this turn. So, I'll play this. I'm gonna swing. Yeah, I'm gonna swing. We'll play Quirrell's End. I guess I should play Quirrell's End first. I don't need the Terrace anymore, so we'll pitch that. This. This can't attack into Bill, so do I need a sack? Kill Bill? And then swing with Golem? Or do I just play this and try to go bigger? Do I play this guy? I can cast. I can't really cast two. I guess I could, but then you get the treasure. Uh, let's do it. Play this. Choose an just cross. Sacrifice. Targeting you. Sacrifice this thing. And then... Go to combat. Swing with Golem. We'll give them the treasure. Yeah, we're gonna go. It looks like they would send all of that anyways. And I just drain them with the shadow summoning, drain them with the oath. As long as the bats live. Yikes. That's not good. bomb. I don't have an answer to that either. Let's see. If I play this, I can play this as a blocker for everybody but this guy. Actually, it still blocks that guy. I think I need to play this as a blocker for the Lotho, right? And the other guys. Probably the best use of mana, so we'll just do this and try to stabilize. mana so we can shadow summoning and gray host right shadow summoning drain drain gray host just trying to drain them out
Vortex. Hello, Gandalf. He's strong, but I can block him. I think I could even take one hit from Gandalf and then leave the flyers. Oh, I see. So we are on team block team. So I have to block like this, maybe? I think if I block like this, then I get three, three, four, five, six, seven damage. If I block like this, then I take eight damage, so that it's one difference. I can get the golem back. I don't want to keep the bats though, so what do I block? Like this? No, I have to. No, I lose the bats no matter what. So, block here. Block here. Then I can block the golem. Okay. Oh, I did this wrong. This was supposed to block that. I made all sorts of mistakes. Oops. I deserve to lose this, because that was massive mistakes on my part. Um, okay, well, we can play you. The creature died under your control this turn. It's on my turn, right? Play this guy. Play this guy. And game, right. Yeah, they have all the food. So I I messed up my blocking last turn, and that's why I'm losing here. It was supposed to go the other way around. So I would have eaten the Charcer, got Golem back. Unfortunately, that just wrecks me here. I mean, I was going to lose anyways because my opponent has um, this thing, which I can't do much about. Alright, they're attacking with everybody. I have to block. So, I have to chump. Chump. Trade. Trade. And this is the only way I live. It looks like a chump chump trade trade. Yeah, I mean, I could... Yeah. Get going back. Get these three. He's there tapped. I can get the four... Yeah, that's a game. Good game. Uh, no attacks in return. That's the blockers. Here, block. Eat the limbas. We'll still die. To a bomb. The fact that I've lived this long with that like this is quite the miracle. But my misplay did wreck me a little. I don't think I would have still won because I don't think I drew anything that would have changed my fortunes there. My opponent had so much food, but yeah. Feels bad, man. On to the next one. Okay, we have all our colors. A so one and a two and a three and a four. Seems good. It's less good, but it's it's blocked. Okay, seems good. Sure. 
that thing. Oh, this was exit. That's too bad. No. I don't want that as a trick. Okay, let's see. Is there a if? Except for the first one they draw, it deals a damage, so I can deal one, two damage, potentially. Something has to die at my turn, though. I don't really have a way of pulling that off. I can play this, but it's not doing a lot this turn. So let's just play blade. Hold up, Orcish Bowmasters. Enter the battlefield. Okay. Creatures you control. Okay. It's annoying. I'm about to take a hit. Uh, yeah. It's just, well. Um, Happens every time a human appears, it's annoying, and I can't really do much about it. Then a mass one. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna have to shoot his face. No blocks. Yep. Put on some sort of human's gun. Face. I can, I think I, I think a Lash of the Balrog, Shadow Summoning, Lash, I guess I can just Lash and kill this thing now, it's probably the better way to do it, okay, Lash, full price, kill this thing, and then swing with you. have a trick, but I'm gonna make them use it, I guess. Okay. I did have the trick. Troublesome. I think we have to play with play this. So I have a defender. Play these guys. Then no attacks to this turn. Oh, they're gonna get menaced the next turn. Have to block. Though I hate that I do. I'm getting wrecked on every front here. Okay, well, Grand is not helping me here, so we'll go ahead and play this. Pitching Grand. That's also not helping me. Okay. We'll equip one of the flyers. Play a land. But I think it's over. I mean, I'm just going to be ch triple jumping next turn. I'm not even... Yeah, they have all that Yeah. Um... Good game. Good game. Oh, I forgot that this thing does that stupid thing. Alright, well, you know. My opponent just had the curve out and I kind of flooded. Also, the, I think their deck was just a little better than mine. I mean, I didn't get any value off that Orchard Bow Master, so that kind of sucked too. So, yeah, everything went bad. <laughs> this, this deck went very south. I don't think it was a terrible deck either. 
which is kind of funny just looking at it i mean i have this a mass thing going on i have denethor i have shadow summoning i have things that benefit off of creation of tokens it's just nothing ever came out in the right order and it didn't work that's not to say that these colors are bad or this is a bad deck i don't think but you know let me know in the comments if you do it if you have any better insight into this format our prizes are pretty meager again just one pack and the gems so we'll go ahead and open the pack some packs Let's see for brothers war but over the top i do not want that i think it's between the mask and the haywire and i think i'll take the mask between these two because i think this has a little bit more upside and use general usefulness. This is kind of more specific, so mask it is. Uh, yeah, War Coil Engine. I mean, if War Coil Engine weren't here, you know, the Siege Veteran is really good. Yeah, and. But, uh, yeah. The Warm Coil Engine is just such a boss. It goes into any deck, any colors. It's a 6-6 six, six with Death Surge and Life Link that becomes two three threes. Such value, such stabilization. It's amazing. Easy pick there. All right. Oh, Spinoderm. That is nice and aggressive. I think I'm still on Hex Gold Slash, but this actually might be the correct pick. Yeah, this is hard. I Actually, I'll take the Spinoderm because it's a rare, but um, there's a reason that Hexcall Slash actually made me almost consider taking it instead. Alright, it's not Green Sun's Twilight. I don't think the Cacophony Scamp is a good early pick. I think it might be either the Lattice Blade Mantis or the Incisor Glider. And I think between them, I'm going to choose the Glider because it fits into more different kinds of decks and can be useful in both the Artifacts deck as well as a Poison deck. So I'll go this way. Um, yeah, I guess Invasion of Radica is pretty good it's just an exile that i can get a 5 5 out of it the other abilities of getting you know two color cards is probably not terribly important i think it's just the fact that it's a it's a exile removal and then it also can get you a 5 5 if you happen to beat it down if it weren't for that i think that maybe the invasion of ergamon or the dread ship or the agent might be the cards that i pick here There and back again. Yeah, I'd take that. I mean, that's basically getting smog on a slow plan and lots of treasures if smog dies. So that is the pick for me. Don't get me wrong. I think Gandalf is fantastic. I've had Gandalf do some pretty f crazy things in terms of turning my sorceries into instants. So very cool. And But uh, there and back again is the pick for me. Ooh, Mary. Seems nice. I mean, I, I don't know if this is actually a right pick because I think the red white deck is mostly supposed to be humans, so Mary comes in and needs the equipment to get first strike and you only draw a card if you attack with another legendary creature. I think the proper correct pick might be Sam here because it gets you a card back and then the ring tempts you. Yeah. Sam's the correct pick. I think Mary's the fun pick, and I'm gonna take Mary. But if you're, you know, smart, you take Sam. I think and that is gonna be it for me with this draft. Let me know what you thought about the draft and the games in the comments below. If I made any major play errors, or also let me know so that I can learn from your wisdom. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. If you'd like to see more of my videos, you can hit subscribe. This is Refresh. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.